All right, we're talking absolute. Um, so the layout I went with was a five by four by two and a half. Um, just keeping it really simple. This sitting on core has been extremely impressive. The reason I want something like this again, I love that five inch pan. I love that um, keeping it simple and I don't want the ball to flare too much. I do have a higher rev rate. So allowing that five inch pan gives me length, but also control and stability off the end of the pattern, which again, that sensor weight block would do for me as well. Uh, so on this shot, beak went around 31, 32. Eyes looking to 18, 19 and around eight down lane. So it should be pretty good. All right, so with this absolute, the situation I'm gonna throw it in um, would be something like a heavier volume, longer pattern, um, but you need a cleaner cover. Uh, with that Sentinel weight block, that big kind of uh, hourglass shape weight block means it really wants to tread, really wants to chug in the middle part of the lane, leaving a really big footprint. So again, having a big weight block like that, sometimes you don't need a huge cover, uh, you need a cleaner cover, and I think that's where Absolute is gonna fall in, in place for me. Um, I might knock that shine down just a little bit with three or 4,000 pad, personally. Uh, but again, if I can't throw like a Supernova, um, Absolute is gonna be my next best choice. All right, so with Absolute, um, something's gonna fit well for my game is, you know, I'm gonna, my strengths are gonna be as I move left and get deeper into part of the lane. And frankly, the deeper I can get into the faster, I'm gonna strike more. And the Absolute lets me do that. Um, again, with that weight block and cover stock combination, it allows me to get into the lane a little bit deeper and really blend it the right way because of that weight block. So I can't wait to throw in that scenario and that's gonna be best for me. I have the... Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Brutal. <laughs>